Hey everyone, Mark the Guitar Guy here, and welcome to my series on chords, or more to the point, basic chords, beginner's chords. So if you're a complete beginner on playing a guitar and you'd like to start somewhere, this video here will be your very, very cool resource for you. And speaking of resources, um, we've got a really cool Jammerama chord book that you can download. There's a link below, it's free. How easy is that? Just click on the link below and you'll, be, you'll have access to all these chord shapes and diagrams. It'll help you out a lot. So, first chord we're going to do today, we're going to actually start a little bit different. Some people start on a different chord to me, but I'm going to start on the D chord. I'm going to play the D chord for you. So, fingering for the D chord. First finger is on the third string, counting from the bottom. One, two, three. On the second fret, second finger. And by the way, you'll notice where my first finger is. It's high high up on the fret. It's not way down the back of the fret. It's not in the very middle. It's a little bit up on the higher end. That's because you'll get a better sound and easier to press down at that point as well. Second finger, bottom string, which is or the first string, second fret. So the two of them in the same fret. Third finger, see how high it goes. The third finger is actually quite far up that fret line. It's not in the middle. It's not way down the beginning. It's really high up. And when we strum that, we only have one open string. That is one string that doesn't have a finger on it, yet we still play it, which is the D string, which is the fourth string. And so we're going to strum from there down. So for this chord, we're only strumming the bottom four strings. Really simple. And if you're strumming an upstroke, it's just a little flick. It doesn't matter if we don't get all the strings, but on the downstroke, try to aim for the bottom four. So missing out the top two strings, aiming for the bottom four strings. There's your D chord.